My name is Shannon Lee Horner and I'm currently an apprentice chef at Wembley Stadium. Me and my granddad used to bake in the kitchen, which made me want to expand my catering knowledge. I had my level one chef diploma and my GCSEs, which were maths, English, science and PE. The difference between studying full time and doing an apprenticeship is you're learning what it feels like to be in a real kitchen and what it feels like to actually have people expecting something on the table within a couple of uh, within a couple of minutes of every every service that you do and being at college you have a set time and set program for you to do which doesn't really show you what you can do within that time at college um what's so good about doing an apprenticeship is you're learning new things you're getting to learn things that you wouldn't learn at college and you're getting an experience of something that you would love to do in your life. Um, my highlight so far would have to be when we cooked for the main person of Delaware North um, where um, we showed what we could do and that we could actually do it within a certain time that we needed to do it. So far it would have to be waking up in the mornings as I was not used to waking up at 5.15 but now I'd say I'm used to it as I've woken up on time every day, got to work every day but that only happened because I set up my alarm an hour before I had to wake up so that I had time to refresh myself and get out of the house on time. The advice I'd give to my friends, because they're all considering to do an apprenticeship, is to go for it as you're going to see if you like the environment that you're working in and if you don't you can change your mind and go back to college or you can just see what you want to do and how, you're, and how it can help you along the way. And who is your culinary idol? Um, I don't really have one, but if I have to say it would have to be Michelle Reginia as when I met him, he was in the kitchen, even though he had a lot of phone calls and meetings to do, he was in the kitchen helping out everyone other than, if you say, Gordon Ramsay, who would scream at everyone because he's been busy or he's let someone mess up halfway down the line of doing prep. I'd say... I, have, I would cook a comfy salmon with comfy potatoes which with um, asparagus and a hollandaise sauce. That would have to be garlic and chilli and seasoning to give your food a bit of spice and a bit of flavour. Um, you're on a desert island so you either have fish or you have wild animals that you could that you could eat, which would mean I would only have to bring some carbohydrates and some fruit and vegetables, so I'd have to bring potatoes and tomatoes just to give them a bit of flavour. My It was to actually open my own restaurant, but I changed that as I saw how much time and effort would have to go into it. and. Now I, all I want to do is get out of stadium work and go into a Michelin star restaurant and then maybe pursue opening up a restaurant halfway through when I've actually learned what I want to learn. I picked to do my apprenticeship with Delaware North because my form tutor at college um, decided to let half of us do work placement at Wembley Stadium which is run by Delaware North. 
and it showed that I could actually put when I put my mind to something I can actually do it and it will it shows that Delaware North could help me throughout the all of what I want to do 